Madam Speaker, too many falsehoods have been spread about the Democrats' multi-trillion dollar tax and spend bill, the most radical and expensive piece of legislation in our history. The American people deserve to know the truth about the grave ramifications of passing this fiscally irresponsible liberal wish list. So let's unpack some of these egregious Pinocchios. For starters, the left has erroneously claimed that the so-called Build Back Better Act is fully paid for and will cost American taxpayers zero dollars. This is false. While we have not yet received the official CBO score, models show that the Biden big government socialist spending package could cost more than double what Democrats have previously reported. The number could be upwards of $4.5 trillion, with $3 trillion of it being in new debt. Additionally, President Biden has touted for months that this legislation will not raise taxes on Americans earning less than $400,000 a year. According to early reports from the Congressional Budget Office, this is completely false as well. A recent analysis from the Tax Policy Center found that the reckless reconciliation bill will hike taxes for 20 to 30 percent of middle class families next year. Yet taxpayers in the top 5 percent will see a combined total tax cut of $32 billion. What a slap in the face to the millions of small businesses, hardworking employees and their families. Lastly. The President and his Democrat allies has, have absurdly stated that passing their pricey package will help ease inflation. Ease inflation? Really? This is completely illogical and defies all reason, unless, of course, your intent is to deceive. Injecting trillions of dollars of borrowed federal money into the economy, with billions of it going to climate change, will only worsen the already burdensome effects of record high inflation. The result will be Americans struggling to afford gas, groceries, and heating bills. Keep in mind, the sole intent of the Biden-Bernie Bankruptcy Act's enormous cost is to fund unpopular and radical policies such as taxpayer-funded abortion, weaponizing the IRS, and mass amnesty for illegal migrants. Oh, and don't forget about the 150-plus new government programs that will further expand the federal government's size and scope. Simply put, the unfortunate truth is that by ramming through their big government socialist spending spree, Democrats are selfishly prioritizing their dangerous far-left agenda over the needs of the American people. Thank you, and I yield back.